Hi, welcome to another ISDC video. My name is Alejandro. Today we will be diving the wreck of the Sucre out of the Hillsboro Inlet in Pompano. As usual, we are going to have two sections of this video. First, we're going to go for the dive and then we're going to talk about the history of the wreck. So please join me and welcome back. So before we hit the water, let's go through some facts of the wreck. This one used to be a 200 foot long by 35 foot wide uh, cargo ship. And nowadays it's resting at more than 200 foot of depth, basically 215 or so. So this dive shouldn't be made by anyone that hasn't uh, technical dive training and the preferred type of training is trimix. The wreck itself is sitting upright and intact with a lovely cargo crane on top of it, which is a beautiful um, picture opportunity that you guys have right there. Uh, also, the main deck is sitting at 190 feet and overall the wreck provides with great penetration opportunities to the engine room, and the bridge. So without further ado, let's go for a dive.
Welcome back, guys. Uh, let's talk about the history of the Sucre. The Sucre was born on April the 2nd, 1957. It was born on a shipyard in Shisha Seebeck in Bremerhaven, Germany. During its active uh, history, the Sucre had different names and belonged to different companies. There's not much to tell about the story of the wreck itself, uh, aside than it was a, a general cargo ship. During the years, it had four names and five different owners. The names it, it used to have were the Louise, the Chiloe 3, the Kenko, and lastly, the Sucre. Its owners were German, were from Chipre, from Chile, and lastly, Honduran owners. Being seized at all, the story of the Sucre ended on April 27th, 1996, when it was sculled and sunk in the coast of Pompano Beach. Okay, we arrived to the end of another video. I really hope you enjoyed the, the dive and the information. Once again, if you liked it, please give us a thumbs up. Please leave your comments. And again, if you haven't done it so far, subscribe to the channel. I hope you enjoyed it once again and see you on our next video.